She is completely empty. I, by the way, got all of my closet thingies from Ikea. This is the Boaxel closet organizer. It's actually very affordable. I have one here, three here, two here, and right here I just have one. And hopefully this fits all my clothes. I don't know if it will, but we're literally gonna do our best. These are adjustable, so if it doesn't fit, I can always move these. Ever since I've been living here, my closet hasn't been this clean and organized. Like I've had stuff in here, but I didn't hang anything because these rods were literally sold out for like the longest time, but I finally got my hands back on them and now I can organize in here and I did laundry. My room is so messy right now because all this stuff was literally in my closet and now that my closet's empty, my room is messy. So that's why we're here to organize. Game plan. As you can tell, this side has one, two, and three layers. So I'm gonna put all of my shirts on this side. Hopefully it fits because if it doesn't, I literally have nothing else. Like this is it, this is my game plan. This is a very small closet compared to my old closet, but like we're gonna make it work because I literally have no choice. <laughs> I'm so grateful for my space though. All of my clothes are over here. This is my bathroom. Do you guys see that? Those are all my clothes in garbage bags. If you guys want to see me organize my bathroom, go watch the video before this because that video, I literally put my blood, sweat, and tears in cleaning this bathroom. It was freaking horrendous. But yeah, okay, let's organize everything because I'm trying to go to sleep. I literally switched my shirt for this video. I was wearing something else in my previous video, but I want this to feel like a different day. <laughs> Yeah, I have a lot of clothes and they're very colorful. This section has white, yellow, orange, and blue. <laughs> That's too small. All right, fuck it, we're gonna make it work. As you guys can tell, some of this stuff is kind of long, so I'm just going to be like folding them, tucking strings in so that it fits better. These are all dresses, right? Oh, what the heck? This is mixed with shirts and dresses. We're just gonna put this somewhere. This is low-key vibe. <laughs> Ooh, I can't wait to see it done. How did this get all mixed? So as I'm editing this, I'm just here like, you know what, let's give y'all a life update because honestly, my life has been kind of freaking crazy and I don't know, we're gonna treat this as like a little podcast moment, but if I'm being honest, my life has changed so much and low key, I'm in my hawker philosopher era. I feel like everything I do, I just think so deep about it and I'm like, you know what, this is for a reason. You know what, this is what the universe wants for me and I find the reason as to why I'm going through what I'm going through and I blame everything on the universe. It is an art. But like, it's kind of a good thing because I feel like I'm growing and I'm learning so much. I feel like I'm rediscovering my love for fashion doing this. Honestly, I feel like I'm gonna end up with extra space for my closet. I have more white stuff. If there's one thing I've learned while being in my 20s, it is that you gotta mess up in order for you to grow. And I think for the longest time, I was so afraid of messing up, which is probably why my life was so stagnant the past two years. To me, it was stagnant at least. But it was because I was scared to mess up because I cared so much about my future. But that's kind of like another way of perfectionism. And low key, that is not really that good for you. Like it's impossible to grow if you have everything under control. Does that make sense? 
I finished putting all of the clothes up. I realized I actually have so much extra space, like right here. These are like my black and brown tops. I don't really wear black. I mean, I have like black dresses, but like these are like black crop tops, making me realize I need more black and I need more brown. Since I have so much extra space here, I'm gonna put all of my skirts right here. They're currently in a basket. The fact that I can put it up, I have space, like I'm definitely gonna be hanging it because then I don't have to like go into a basket to look for my mini skirt, which is so convenient. I didn't realize how much extra space I would have but I'm like so glad and then also down here I have this entire bottom row because all of my crop tops fit up here So I'm just gonna put all of my sweatpants and pants down here I think that's like a genius idea like I really came up with the most efficient like closet organization system I'm really proud of that because it's gonna fit all of my clothes like I don't have to go in baskets Only thing is this is not gonna fit all of my hoodies and jackets But I wasn't planning on putting that stuff up anyway, so I don't know where I'm gonna be putting that stuff i'm gonna be putting all my mini skirts on a hanger now <laughs> my mini skirts are not going here but i'm just gonna put them all on here just so that i can stay organized and then i will move it over there I think it was last summer, which was summer of 2022, I decided that I really want to change my life. I'm tired of living this way. I want my life to change. And guess what? The universe did that for me. I manifested it. I moved out. I switched my agencies. I quit nicotine, guys, which is kind of crazy. I left my last relationship. I've been taking care of my skin, so my skin has been so good recently. I go to the gym again. My life recently has been so good. I'm feeling so healthy. When I tell you guys the universe listens, I mean the universe is freaking listening. What I'm trying to get at is if you want your life to change you're gonna expect change to actually happen some people might leave your life your habits might change what you do on a daily might change which sounds so obvious but once you're facing it i understand how scary it can be so if there's one tip i want to give you guys it is to chase the scary feeling because that's when you know you're doing something different and you're gonna grow and it's gonna elevate you honestly at this point i do everything in my life for the plot for the storyline for the character development all right guys welcome it's the next morning here is the closet the top, the bottom, the long dresses. We have all these shorter dresses and in multiple colors. We have mini skirts over here. Right here we have like my gray and black and brown top. And down here are other short dresses but in the other colors. Now we're gonna go ahead and organize all of my joggers or pants and throw them down here. <laughs> Hello, hello guys. So I have no idea like when was the last time I filmed for this video, but this video is consisting of me from many different days trying to like make this closet look as cute as possible. So I really don't remember where I left off. Down there, I actually put those baskets there. Those baskets are just for storage. And then I put two bins down there too. The only thing I'm really gonna do today is of course I'm gonna organize this. Oh, also up here, I put my bins up here. If you guys remember, I used to have all of my purses in these bins and so I'm gonna do the same thing like I'm gonna throw all my purses in there because I just think that would look really cute Really creative as you guys know. I love 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 color I just think it's so fun one thing that you guys really love that I used to have is my shoe rack with all of my heels But the thing is I don't really have any space for something like that I probably could do it when the room next to my bedroom is like finally done as you guys know That's gonna be like my living room area Which we have not started on because my parents currently have way too many projects going on until then my heels won't really have anywhere to go or like my shoe rack just hang in there with me guys we're gonna end off the video with one more voiceover because low-key this is kind of fun but if i'm being honest the crickets outside are kind of annoying anyways i just want to say guys to be honest life is kind of hard and i say that with a little laughter because i use humor to cope but to be honest life is hard and i really hope that you guys don't see my life as something super freaking perfect because it is anything but that i am struggling and honestly i think we all are and i hope you guys can find comfort when it comes to like watching my videos or like just seeing my content in general i want you guys to know that i'm here for you guys dm me if you guys need anything but honestly something i've been telling myself is that yes life is really hard but i can't help but feel like it's hard because it's preparing me for a greater purpose i know universe has something in store for all of us and also i hope you guys don't forget you guys are way stronger than you guys think you are point blank period all right guys so that is it for today's little closet organization video but here it is y'all see that 
got the purses. I think they look really cute. I actually might end up like mix matching all the purses. Right now they're kind of in color coordination, which I don't know if I like that. I think I want to mix match it. That might just be prettier and messier to the eye, but like prettier because it's messy. I like that up here it is full all the way to down here in terms of color and like clothes. So I actually really like how that turned out. Originally, I wasn't going to put any of the purses up there. Right now, I just have this cowgirl hat right here because I love this. I literally just bought it today. You guys know I love cowgirl hats, so I'm probably going to figure out where I can wear this. But I think this is really cute. I'm literally sweating right now because it's so hot. This is how I ended up organizing this side. Obviously, I have some heels here. I love these heels because I actually thrifted these. These are from Nine West and look at how like Y2K they are. Literally like short, buckled. I feel like I got them for like less than $10, which is so freaking worth it. Shop from Amazon Candle from Target. And then I have this coach bag right here. This one's green and it's so pretty. I love, love, love this bag. This was also thrifted, so I love it so much. I haven't worn it anywhere yet, but I just think it's so pretty. It's such a statement piece. So I do want it to be showing. And then I just put up that painting. Up here is really empty and I don't really have any plans for it at the current moment. I also put a purse here because I just felt like this side needed like a little oomph. Like I said, I don't really have like any official plans up here, but if you guys have any ideas, like definitely let me know. I'm really open. If anything, I could just extend this higher to the wall. That way I could have more hangers going this way and I could actually hang up like all of my sweaters, all my jackets because those were the one things I just couldn't find space for. I definitely know I'm going to do more to this closet, but for now, that is all I'm going to do. Super colorful and happy and this is definitely way better than what I was expecting when I was thinking about this closet. So I'm grateful no matter what. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Make sure to let me know what other videos you guys want to see from me. And also let me know if you guys like how the closet turned out. I feel like this is the best I can do. Anyways, I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Bye. Mwah.